Hi everyone, my name is Barbara. Welcome back to my Excel channel. Today I'm going to show you two ways to not use merged cells. Now merged cells in Excel can cause all sorts of issues with your formulas and it's best to avoid them. So I'm going to show you two ways to make it look as good as a merged cell without merging the cells. So go to the cell on the far left that you would have merged across say A and B select this out and then go to the home tab and the alignment group and you, what you want is increase indent and click away and what you can do is you can position your text so it looks like a merged cell and looks as good as for, for presentation it looks as good as a merged cell but doesn't interfere with any of the functionality of your spreadsheet method two again so this is what we previously would have merge we would have, we would have merged a and b so select the cells that you would have merged in this case and then right click and go to format cells go to the alignment tab and in the text alignment what you want is center across selection and then hit okay so again what we have is Visually, it looks like a merged cell, but it's not a merged cell and it won't affect your functionality. So method one, what you can do is you can select the cell that you normally would have merged, the far left of the cell you normally would have merged, home tab and alignment and increase your indentation. The second method is select the cells you would have merged, right click format cells and straight into your alignment tab horizontal text alignment center across selection. I hope you enjoyed the tip. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps the channel. If you did like the video, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you will get notified when I upload a new video. I'll also leave a link to my Excel tips playlist. So over a hundred videos there, I'm sure you'll find something interesting to watch. Thanks again.